I wanted to say something about the possibility of a personal immortality in the sense of a survival of an individuated consciousness after the corporeal demise of the vehicle of consciousness. Assuming that it's true, it's true. Taking the, the eyewitness accounts uh, such as Yogananda or presumably the disciples of Jesus as being true, well, then it happens. The question then arises in my mind, let's say for a uh, Yukteswar, Yogananda's guru, who was resurrected, manifested in uh, Yogananda's hotel room, well, what happens after that, after that length of time that one persists as an individual in whatever realms, on whatever mansion, street in heaven one persists, where does one go from there? And the literature suggests that eventually that body also dissolves after a particular eternity or age. It's, uh, I don't really have a problem with it. Uh, I guess the, the scientist in me, the materialist, physicalist that I am, does not preclude various forms of spirituality and metaphysics. They're just not incompatible in my overall state of being, if that makes any sense.